Hello everybody, so Cal Thero here, welcome back to another episode of LSPDFR. Today we are going to be a San Andreas Highway Patrol. We're going to be using the second to last vehicle that I have left to use in this Michigan State Police Pack that I've been using at the request of one of the subscribers here that uh, commented on it and waited patiently for about four or five months until uh, I had to start recording LSPDFR again. We're over here on US Route 15 in my uh, typical spot that I like to hang out at. Uh, we're going to be looking for speeders mostly. Uh, but if we get a call out that's highway related, we will definitely respond to it as well. Uh, let's turn our headlights on. So we're going to set pet or sit. <laughs> yeah, we're going to be set up down here with our radar system on. In fact, let's turn it on right now. And we are going to see if we can catch any speeders. Posted speed limit here is 60, so that's what we're looking for today. And there we go right there, 71. So we got a black muscle car in the number two lane. Looks like they're getting off right here. Yep. Now we're going to be pulling over. Looks like a Dukes. Got him clocked doing 71 and a 60, so that didn't take long at all. So we're going to just wait till we get around this bend, and then uh, we're going to pull him over because there's a good pullover spot up here where it's safe for uh, me to get out of the vehicle. Especially on a rainy day like this, you shouldn't be driving this crazy, but it is what it is. 114 at dispatch, gonna be attempting to stop a Black Dukes. Uh, we're gonna be facing east on, uh, east northeast on Sonora Way. The uh, license on that vehicle is 45 Roger Queen X Ray 568. Darian Swift has an expired license. A traffic violation. Okay. Approach with caution. Occupied times one. Oops, I don't need my gun. Good morning, sir. My name is Trooper Thiel with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. Reason for the stop is I got your clock doing 71 and a 60. Do you got your license, registration, and proof of insurance? Seems nervous. All right. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Expired. Oh, yeah. His license is definitely expired. Uh, where are you coming from in such a hurry? Friends home? Are you heading home, then? Are you going to go see another friend? Right on, man. Hey, uh, just real quick. I'm looking down at your license. Did you know it's expired? God never knew it. Okay. I, I get that. It happens. I'll, um, I'm going to go back to my system here and uh, double check it, and then I'll be right back with you, okay? So his license is definitely expired. Forgot about it. It happens. People do do that. Uh, 155 days. And yeah, I mean, that's a while, but it's not like it's the end of the world here. Um, He's my first stop of the day. I'm going to cut him a break. Doing 11 over. I probably should write him a ticket, but I'm going to cut him a good break here. Alright, sir, here's your information back. I did confirm your license is expired. I, I appreciate you being honest and saying that you forgot to renew it. Um, guess what, man? I am going to cut you a huge break here. I am not going to be citing you today for the speed, and I'm not going to be citing you for the uh, expired license. Do me a favor, slow it down. It is raining out here pretty good. Don't want to see you end up in an accident. As well as do me a favor and get the uh, license... Uh, renewed and take care of it good for me please what are these people doing because you never know when you have idiots like this out here that are behind me but uh, anyway sir thanks again for stopping and uh, I hope you have a good rest of your morning take care all right so first stop of the day our verbal warning has been given out so he's gonna be on his way this guy has underglow in front of me. If he continue, yeah, he's continuing this way. Okay. I guess I'm gonna be stopping him real quick. Okay. Let's light him up. If he pulls over on the bend here, there's a good amount of space to pull over on. Right by that uh, cut off there onto that dirt road. Come on, dude, pull it over right here. Oh, this is a bad spot around a blind corner. I'm going to sit way over here. 
I'm gonna aim my car like this. You typically want to aim this way. A 114 at dispatch, gonna be facing south, southwest uh, on the transition to US Route 15. Need a 27 or need a 28 on a 28 X ray Adam Echo 315. Expired license. Well, what do you know? Approach with caution. What's going on here? Good morning, sir. My name is Trooper Thero with the San Andreas the Highway Patrol. The reason I'm stopping you today is your vehicle has underglow lighting on it. Um, can I ask him about that? I don't think I can. People documents, violations. Okay. Do you have your uh, license, registration, and proof of insurance for the vehicle? Oh, his license is way expired. All right. Uh, just real quick, did you know that your license is expired here? I know I have a, I like the license because I look young in the photo. Okay, well, you got to update that, man. You can't just have like an 18-year-old picture of you and then you're like in your 30s or 40s, okay? Got to be able to identify you. Let's go ahead and... Whoops, I didn't mean to walk off. Go ahead and just uh, stay put and I'll be right back with you. Yeah, normally you want to angle your car like this, just because if he gets out and starts blasting, I am, like, primed for being shot in the face right here. But, traffic comes around the corner, I am primed to getting smashed into, and the car going into me. Okay, yeah, his license has been expired for a while, and, yeah, okay, well, unfortunately for him, I already gave out my one freebie, so... We're going to be going ahead and citing him for both things. So, uh, documents, he has expired, uh, where is it? License, expired driver's license. He's getting that. And then maybe under equipment. He on underglow prohibited while in motion. There we go. Okay. So he's going to be getting cited for those, those two things. And we're going to give him a notice to appear because he does need to get the underglow taken care of. Alright sir, I'm going to be signing you for both the underglow and the expired license with the notice to appear. You have to appear in court and prove that the uh, light's been taken off of this vehicle, okay? It's going to be a fine of $220. I need your signature at the bottom. It's not an admission to guilt, it's just saying that you received it from me. All right, I appreciate that. You have any questions for me? All right, good. When I return to my vehicle, you're free to go, okay? I already rolled up his window. Didn't even get a chance to say, have a nice day. i be somewhat polite to him. All right. So he's taken off now. He kind of sped away. I think he's a little pissed off at us, but it is what it is. I gave out my freebie already. So... Um, we're going to be code 4, and uh, we're going to get set back up in our spot here, and then we'll be 10-8 again. Oh, wow. My uh, radar just auto-locked onto that guy. He was going so fast. So, we have this. It looks like a Stainyard, I want to say, that is in the number 2 lane getting off right now. Uh, my radar went off, auto-clocked him at 75, so he was flying down here. Got him for 15 over. That's pretty fast. From the uh, posted speed limit. When my radar detector is catching you on the auto, you uh, you got to be going really fast in order for that to happen. So, we're going to be stopping him. Uh, dispatch need a 28 on a black standard. 44 Edward Lincoln Jacob 123. Edward Lincoln 123. Target is 10-4. Mikayla Manders is the owner of it. He's got three citations. Damn, he's got me down in a ditch. I'm going to stay back here because, yeah, as far as where he's pulled over, he's got me down in a ditch here practically. Uh, I don't like being next to the road, but if the dirt gives and this car starts to slide, it's going to slide right over me. Good morning, ma'am. My name is Trooper Thero with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. Reason for the stop is I got your clock doing 75 and a 60. Um, where are we heading to in such a hurry? Going grocery shopping? All right. Uh, were you planning on making it there? Driving this fast in the rain is not safe, okay? Where are you coming from? Your house? 
I'm from work? Okay. Have you been doing any drugs or anything? Drugs is good for our wellness. Well, some of them are, not all of them. You haven't been drinking, have you? Don't need to answer that. Well, you don't have to. I was it'd be appreciated if you did. Why don't you go ahead and give me your license, registration, and proof of insurance? Thanks. Okay, just sit tight and I'll be right back with you. I said something about the odor of narcotics from the vehicle. 114 at dispatch. Can I get a K9 unit out here? Can I have a K9 unit uh, search the vehicle. Yeah, everything's good there. And everything's good there too. Okay. All right, ma'am, I'm gonna hang on to your information here. I have a unit that's showing up right now. He has a, a canine dog with him. I'm getting the odor of narcotics from the vehicle. It's emitting from your vehicle from somewhere. At least that's what I think. I'm gonna have the canine unit double check. If the dog does alert to it, I have probable cause to search you and the vehicle, okay? I'm gonna hang on to her information. Oh, cool, it's a female deputy too. Hey, you wanna uh, check the vehicle for me? Got Chop over here looking. Keep the road semi uh, safe for the dog here so he can search the vehicle. Maybe not have my back to traffic though, too. K9 did not alert. Appreciate it. Oh, I guess I'm just going to be sighting her. I appreciate your help. You go ahead and take off. Get out of the rain. It's it's bad out here. It's coming down. Alright, well, K9 didn't alert to anything, so I can't search her vehicle, even though I'm smelling something. So, I'm just going to be getting her for speeding. And, uh... We're going to get her for 15 to 20 over. I'm going to hit her with the full uh, speed here. Uh, not... Not a notice to appear. There we go. All right, ma'am. Uh, the K9 didn't alert to anything, so I don't have probable cause to search you or the vehicle. So we're gonna just uh, leave that as that. Um, I'm just gonna take your word for it that you don't have anything in here. I am gonna be citing you though for doing 15 over the posted speed limit here. I need your signature at the bottom of the ticket. It's not an admission to guilt or anything. It's just acknowledging that you received the ticket from me and that you're going to take care of it in 30 days by either uh, paying the fine or by uh, going to court to uh, dispute it, okay? you have any questions for me? All right, great. Have a great rest of your morning. Please slow it down because it is dangerous conditions out here, okay? Thank you. Alright, so we gave her back her information, we cited her for her speed, we're going to be code 4, and uh, we're going to be back out 10-8 once we get back to our spot here. I mean, 15 over, my goodness. Ridiculous. Alright, we got reports of a reckless driver on the highway here, they want us to uh, intercept, so... I was sitting on this side of the road, but... We'll uh, take a look here and see. Oh, yeah, they're deaf. Man, they are moving it. I could see them visually going pretty quick here. All right, let's see if we can catch up to them real quick. Reckless driver, huh? Everybody else is yielding but them. Uh, okay, it looks like they're not going to stop. All right, 114 to dispatch. This person is not stopping. Uh, we're going to be heading north on U.S. Route 15, about to hit uh, U.S. Route 13. Uh, there's a sheriff unit. There's two sheriff units, three sheriff units. All right, there's all my backup. They're up ahead. Uh, need a vehicle check on the vehicle. 
So that's 6 5 King George William 913. Owned by a Jane West. Okay. Whoa, brake checking me hard. So they are, uh, tra geez, brake checking and changing lanes again. My backup with me? I lost all my backup. Let's go ahead and request some additional units. Uh, 114 to dispatch. We are exiting at the Sandy Shores exit slash Route 68. Actually, I think this is the 68 exit. Um, suspect is TC'd with another vehicle. They are continuing to TC with another vehicle. Okay, suspect is getting out. Suspect is on foot. Suspect is on foot. We are running... She's running north on the on-ramp onto the 13. It looks like there's another unit coming in from the north. Yep, blocker. There you go. She's boxed in. She ain't going nowhere. Stop running. Oh, they just tased her. Give it up, ma'am. Give it up. Hands up. Hands up. I'm trying to keep the cross out of the way here. I'm... Kind of like right in the way. Let me get over here away from my car. Partner seems to have him covered. Let them take care of it. There we go. There's our other backup unit. Yeah, I would consider her arrested too. Do uh, you got anything illegal on you I need to be concerned with? Knives, guns, drugs, RPGs? No sir, I'm harmless. Are you harmless? Oh, you took off from me. Got reports of you driving recklessly and you decided you weren't going to stop. And then you hit somebody's vehicle up there on the off-ramp. Oh, okay, you're harmless, huh? Just cocaine and PCP? You know, that's totally harmless. Dispatch 2729, Jane West. It is the RO of the vehicle. And uh, we'll call PT for her, too. In fact, I think this charger unit's going to just take her. Oh, yeah, okay, cool. And I see her vehicle up there. I'm going to go ahead and let them take her. I'm going to get into my cruiser here. I'm going to back up on the on-ramp here. Hopefully not scrape at my cruiser or anybody else's cars. There we go. Park right here so they can see my big gumball on top. I know to move over. Well, this is her car. Not in too bad a shape, even though she rear-ended somebody twice. Take a look and see what the kind of damage she did. Nunchucks and a sniper rifle, but I'm harmless. Whoops, put that away. All right, let's take it out again. There we go. See what kind of damage we have on the vehicle here. It's still morning, so it's kind of dark out, especially with the uh, rain. Looks like she didn't do any damage to her vehicle. And the other person didn't stay, so it must not have been any damage to them too. There's just the damage of slamming on the brakes at me here and then backing into me, so it is what it is. But uh, anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of LSPDFR. Let me know down in the comments below what you thought, and until next time, take care.